Well, good morning, folks. Hey, we're back at Lake Murray again. We're fixing to go out and try to catch maybe some crappers, maybe some uh, stripers. They, I don't know yet, but I want to show you what these ducks over here feed on. Them jokers feed on, and I'm going to try to zoom in. They feed on grass seed. You see them? Grass seed is what they feed on. Now they're eating the grass seed. Look at them. They wait for the grass to get high and it seeds out and they start eating the grass seed and they rake it all the way to the top. Ain't that something? Them jokers know they pretty. And they love the old fishermen. Hey, I hope all y'all out there and, and YouTube land love the old fishermen too. We gonna go out today and, and see what we can do with some fish. We having a good time and we the main thing is we loving life. We loving life. Thanks for being with me on another episode of loving life and the boat's ready to back in the water and the sun is coming up. Hey, you can't beat it. The sun is coming up. And we're gonna walk back down here to the truck. Appreciate each and every one of you. Thanks for watching the old fisherman videos. But anyhow, we're gonna let y'all go. We got a boat, a fella pulling out the way. We're gonna unload our boat. I asked him, I said, you caught any bass lately? He said he ain't caught for three bass in the last month. So he ain't doing good. And we got another boat coming in here. My buddy uh, is coming in, Lewis. Lewis is coming in to go fishing. And he's waving at me. And we're gonna do a little video of old Lewis driving up. Now you're talking about a fancy boat. Now that Lewis, he's profiling. He's got one of them blue wave boats and you can't beat that. See, he's getting out the truck. He works at VC Summer, he's a buddy of mine. Old Lewis. Hey, and uh, we're gonna put him on YouTube. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for being with the old fisherman on another episode of Loving Life. Hey, watch y'all say we go fishing and uh, and we're gonna love some life today on Lake Murray. Hey, let's go fishing. Good morning, folks. Hey, the old fisherman back with you on Lake Murray again today. See if we can catch something. Stripers or, or crappers. We're gonna fish for both today. See what we can do. A lot of boats out here on a Tuesday morning after the holidays. Can't believe it. A lot of trucks at the ramp, anyhow. I don't know if there's a bass tournament coming up or what. But there's a lot of bass boats out here. A lot of them. Let's see if we can find something. Oh, there he is. I already got one. I already got one. It's going the other way. The all going trolling motor is going the other way too. See if I can turn this boat away from this sun. I already got one. How about that, folks? I already got number one. I ain't fished in here in a while. Hey, maybe I've been missing out. Maybe I've been missing out. We got a boat coming up on us. Maybe I've been missing out. We got our first fish of the day with a boat coming on top of us. Huh, yonder going, yonder going. Look at yonder going. Out right here in the front of the boat. Come on over here, fish. Come on over here, fish. Number one, son, number one. Come in here. Hey, number one striper. What? Number one striper. How about that? Oh, oh. Man. He's mean. Y'all bear with me. Let me get him off. I'll show him to you. <laughs> He's about three pounds. So, a nice one, though. Huh? Put him in the box. Let's see if we can get a nothing. Let's see if we can get a nothing here. Lake Murray. Loving life. Using a boy ducket flutter spoon with a poly flash on the back that I tied on. Hey, they love that poly flash now. You know, there's no way in the world to know if it makes that big a difference. What I've really seen is a, a hookup ratio. Most of them are grabbing in the mouth, where a lot of times I was hooking them on the side, they grabbing it in the mouth now what I see, the difference I see. 
Well, hello, folks. We moved around the cove. Next cove over, and I see some fish down there. I don't know if they're going to bite or not. We're going to try to find out, though. I believe we got some stripers in here. I believe we're going to catch them in here. I see plenty of fish. I believe we done fell into them. Let's see if we can catch them. I believe it's fish there. I know it is. Them stripers. Them stripers. We've got to make them bite. They all in here. They all in here. Let's put it at 45 and work this thing. What you got to do? Drop it out and 45 it. See if we can catch one. There he is. What I tell you? Huh? What I tell you? What I tell you? I know what I'm looking at. We looking at stripers. I don't know how big they're gonna be, but we're looking at stripe. Uh oh, he got off. Dog gone, lost it. Oh, nothing hit it. <laughs> it was a nothing behind it right there. We got plenty of them down here, but they don't look like big fish. That and then I come out and see me. Might run them off. They don't look like big fish, they like small fish, but plenty of them. Plenty of them. Let's see if we can get another one to bite. I knew them was stripes, but I don't know how big they are. That doggone joker got off right at the top of the water. There he is. Got him again. Hey, we got him. We got on him now. I knew when I stopped the boat what I was seeing. Plenty of them. I just don't know how big they are. Don't know how big they are, but there's some of them. A bunch of them in there. Let's see if we can catch them right quick. Look at that, that's a nice one. Ain't nothing wrong with that one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Look at that bone daddy rod. Uh-oh. Don't go boat and come on top of me. We got to hold him down because he's coming on top of me. This is the boat. I don't know who that is. Hey, let's see if we can get another. Let's see if we can get this near. Let's see if we can get this near. Oh, look at him. Look at him, what a fish. Look at that, what a fish. Good one. Oh, Lord. Oh, my. Look at that, what a fish. My gosh. Look at that, what a fish, people. Huh. Look at that, what a fish. My goodness. That is a good one, that buddy. That is a good one. Oh, Lord. I can't hold it. So good. Look at him. Look at the size of that one. That's a pretty one, ain't it? Got me a little excited. I see all these fish. Oh, my goodness sakes alive. We got a boat hopscotching along with me. Let's see if we can get them done. Drop it to the bottom where the big girls line. They in here. This is my old honey hole. I hadn't fished in a while. Hey, they in here too. They in here. I can tell you that right now. You make them bite, they in here. They in here. No doubt. You drove of them in here. And yeah, they gonna bite. We can catch them. There he is. There he is. Oh my, there he goes. What? There he goes. That's a good one. Huh? That's a good one. That's another good one. We done fell into the mother load. That's what we done done. We done fell into the mother load. Hey, die. Huh? What? Look at that joker pool. Huh? Look at that joker pool. My goodness, that's a good one. That is a good one. That is a good one. A good one, buddy. What? I mean a super dog magnet. What? Look at him. Look at him what we just got. Another super dog magnet. Big old knife. Big old fish. Mm. Oh my. Big old fish. You got a big old net too. And there he goes. Get him out that doggone net. Now we get the hook off of him. Hey, we need to put the boat on spot lock. We're gonna be pushed off the fish. Look at that. Look at that water fish. That's a big one, ain't it? That's a good one. Huh? Let's get another. Let's get another. What y'all say? Hey, we in here. They in here. Got me where I can't hardly talk. I'm so excited. I get excited when I'm on fish when I see them like that. 
I get excited. I can't help it. Whew. Wearing me out, I know that. Wearing me out. Turn that boat, get it back into the sun. See if we can get a nut. They like it at an angle though. They don't like it. I gotta get it off spot like to catch them. Put it at an angle. Just put it at an angle. So we get them nothing. I don't see them like I did. I kind of move on them back down and see what happened. They kind of, there, you, there was a bite right there. One hit it. A little one. One had it. Got people out there watching me. Golly, come on now. I know some down there. They up high. They way suspended right now. Them jokes are probably gonna hit all the way to the top if I bring it all the way to the top. That's where they at. There you go. There you go. There you go. I called it, didn't I? Didn't I call it? Hold it. There he goes. Ain't that big, but there he goes. I don't know. He might be bigger than I think. Great day, them jokers are pulling. They pulling. Got old Boom Daddy stretched out. Got him in the back of the head. Got him in the back of the head. Good one. Ain't nothing wrong with that fish. A big old fish. What? Big old fish. Good gosh. He just, he now he's side in the pool. Oh, Lord, he's going to tap my net. Great day. Tap my net. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, day he nailed it. What? Hold on, man. Hold on, babies. Hold on. Hold on. Them jokers are mean. I can't tell y'all how mean they are. Look at him. Look at that what a doggone fish. That's a beauty, ain't it? Hey, day. The slabs. I mean, slabs. Oh, I love catching these jokers. I can't tell y'all how many I done caught on this one boy duck at Fluttersmoor. I have taught, caught a bunch of fish off this boy duck at Fluttersmoor. A bunch of them. They sure won it at a 45, I'll tell you that. There's still some in there and they suspended. They way up. They all they one step from, from school is what they are. They one step from school. What they are. Hey, they ain't a soul over here in that other boat left is one in the next cove over there. These fish might not bite one day and come the next day, eat it up. You just don't know from day to day, eye with eye. It's, it's, uh, we got a front coming in with rain. We hadn't had a rain front in a while, and we got one hit it right there on the way down. We hadn't had a rain front in a while, and we got a front coming in with rain. They, there was a bite right there. There he is, got him. Got him, got him, got him. That's a good one. That's a good one. Oh my goodness, that is a good one, folks. Look at that rod. Huh, look at that rod. Oh my, look at that rod. Big old fish. Oh, got him in the back of the head, wasn't it? But he's still a good fish. Oh Lord, Lord have mercy. Oh, he got off. That was a good one. Son of a gun. <laughs> That's what you call a lucky rock fish. He was the same size as us. He was a good one. Man, that joke was pulling. Mm, 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 mm. Man, try to get a nut, and that's all we can do. Get a nut. There you <laughs> That didn't take long. <laughs> that didn't take long, did it? Huh? That didn't take long. Oh my, that didn't take long at all. Great day. Oh my goodness. You don't love this, like I said before. You don't love life. I thought he got off the way he was. Oh, he did get off. Dad, blame it. What's going on? Oh, Lord, we done lost two straight. Huh? They want me to have to pull and not catch the limb and quit. What it is. 
but my goodness, we done lost two big and straight. That's going to run them out of him. I promise you, that's going to run them out of him. It always does. Maybe not today. We're going to have to think positive. Golly bum. They're going to run them out of him free. Still see a few, though. Get a slant on the line. That's two big old fish done got off. Now, what in the world's going on? It's bad luck. That's all this to it. Bad luck. We got them down there. I wasn't down far enough on that one. Got to get Bone Daddy Rod down there. Get down there, Bone Daddy. We ain't got time to be playing. We got to get down there to catch some fish. And they're playing fish all over the screen. What? Fish all over the screen. They done come alive in this cove. Okay, day. Man, get down there. We might get one on this one. Okay, let's see. Nope, not that time. Oh, Lord. I can't believe I lost two straight like that. Man, it was, both of them was good fish. Mm, 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 mm. Let's put that little whip on that line, that circle swing, see what happens. Let's see if we can do something with the circle swing. Uh-uh, that time. Drop back there. They're getting used to it now. Steel fish there. They ain't got used to it. Beat the boat and stir them up. Beat the boat and stir them up. There you go. That circle swing got him, didn't it? That circle swing got him. Let me tell you that much. It got him. That circle swing is a killer from Manila. That's all I got to say. A killer from Manila. What? Oh, that's a good one, too. Great. They got loose and drag when you see when that side's coming up. Oh, he'll break your line. He'll break your line, folks. He will break your line. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Circle back around, boy. He took it, too, buddy. He swallowed that flutter spoon. He swallowed that flutter spoon, buddy. Swallowed it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Huh. He swallowed it. Oh, my. Look at here. Great day. Look at him. Nice one. Huh. Nice one. Good morning, folks. Hey, the old fisherman back with you. We are uh, going to try to catch some stripers this morning. Sun's up a little bit. Breeze is blowing again. And we're going to see what we can do here on this lake. See if we can stir something up. Make something bite. Stir them up. Smell the roses. Catch a limber striper and then try to go crappy fishing. That's what we're going to do. What we're going to do. We're using the uh, H2O Express rod this morning, uh, seven foot. It's one quarter to three quarter ounce, uh, 12, 20 pound test line. I like that one quarter to three quarter with the flutter spoon. It's a little stiffer than Bone Daddy. Bone Daddy is an ocean rod, saltwater rod. Oh, one hit it on already. Golly, about to take it out of my hand. We talking and going on. Um, but we're using braid line on. Uh oh, he got off. Dog, don't it? So that braid line don't give much. Got off. First one got off. Huh? Let me know. And uh, braid line don't give much. He'll jerk it out your hand with this rod. The Bone Daddy absorbs a lot of the bite on the end. I like the Bone Daddy, but I like to use both rods. Both of them have got a different feel. This one here is really, when they hit this one, they'll, they'll knock it out your hand if you don't watch it. Yeah, see ya. Got him again. Got him again. Got him again. We got to get our drag a little tighter. Hey, we got him again. Oh my, we got him again. I go to pulling too, so let me tell you. Uh, it, I don't, uh, he got off. What is going on? My hook, I tell you, I need to change these hooks. They done got dull or something. It look all right, but I don't know. I'll be doggone dang and lost the first two fish. That is not good. Mm. That's one thing I like about the Bone Daddy rod. It's got a little bend on it, and it can absorb some of that pull. 
These jokers are pulling, ripping it out the heads is what they're doing. They're ripping it out the heads. We got them all up under us, folks. This fish all up under us. See if we can catch them. See if we can catch nothing. You got to get that drag tight, because it's, when they hit it, you got to set the hook. You don't set the hook, you'll lose them. And a lot of times that drag, I loosen it up while I'm catching the fish, keep them breaking that dog on line. But a lot of times, it don't set the hook good if that drag ain't tight when you're pulling it up. And they bite, there you there he is. Hey, they out there, ain't they? Okay, they, they out there and they killing this. They killing this flood of spawn. Going all different directions, that's why they pulled it loose. Got him in the back of the head is what it is. We got him in the back of the head. We got him in the back of the head. Oh, my folks. Old blue rod now. That joker pulled. That joker's pulling. Huh. He's pulling. Great. They got him in the back of the head is what it is. Swatted at it. That's why we losing them. They swatting at it and snagging the cell. This is what they doing. Snagging the cell. Hey, day. Boy, they biting it, day. If we can just get out there, catch them. We hooked them, we ain't catch them. Hitting the back of the head. That's why he's pulling stuff. Snag hooked him. That's what you call an unlucky fish right there, folks. He's snag hooking. Snag hooking. Hey, weigh about three pounds. But snag hooking. I can get in some 10, 12 pounds, that probably ain't gonna happen. Hey, he's a nice one though. Whoa, almost threw him out in the lake. Joker kicked side the barrel and went out, almost went out in the lake. Well, that would have been a quick release. Instead, he's in the grease. Okay. Let's see if we can catch another. I like catching them on this rod because you feel every bit of it on this rod. Yeah, there ain't nothing you don't feel. Boy, they out here. It's, it's rockfish stripers all in this in this drop out here everywhere. Hey, folks, we lashed them to another one. Turned off the camera for a little bit. As soon as I did, boom, gone. Joker pulling too. Pulling. See if you get off. Done lost two. This is number two. They hook them in the back of the head. They ain't taking. That's why they're getting off. They change direction, it pulls loose. You can feel them changing direction because it's not in their mouth. It's in the back of their head. That's what it is. Back of their head. Joker's pulling now. They pull when they hook in the back of the head. Now I'll tell you that, they don't have to be a big fish. They don't have to be a big fish. Hey, day that sucker's pulling. I ain't believing how he's pulling. He must be under the chin or something. I can't hardly get him in. My old shoulder's gonna be wide out again. That's a good fish. That's a real good fish. That's why he's pulling. That's a big fish. That is a good one. He's hooked in the mouth. That's a big one. Hey, that's a good fish. That, that is a jumbo. A jumbo magnum. Huh, look at that. Look at the size of that one. Look at it like a shark. Oh my, that's about a seven pounder. Oh, a big one. Great. Hey, he's gonna fill the net up. Oh, I can't hardly lift it, folks. I feel big fish. I never hurt my back for lifting it. Oh, Lord. I hurt my back lifting that fish up. Huh. I'm going to have to get the grip of it on him. I can't hold that fish. That is a big one. That, my friend, is a jumbo magnum. If I can get him in this clippers, I want y'all to see this. Look at that. Look at the size of that fish. That's a big one, folks. That is a big one. Huh. Look at the size. Look at that spoon. Huh. Oh, my. You know, I hurt my back, though. My back's hurting holding him up. That's how heavy he is. Hey. Dang, what a fish. What? That is a good one, folks. Look at him. Look at the size of that fish. Oh, my. Goodness, look at the size of that 
doggone fish. That's the biggest one I caught in a while right there. Man, my goodness. That's a 25 inch fish. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey, dang. Y'all can see how he's eat up that dog on flood of stuff. Look at it. Teeth marks all over. They tore the hair off of it. They laying it to it, ain't they? You catch one that size on this stiff rod. It's a light rod. You pull your arm off. Hey, day they'll pull your arm off. We went out in 41 foot of water. We went up shallow, didn't get a bite. Went back out deeper, got a bite. I'm thinking we need to be deeper. What I'm thinking, deeper is the key. Deeper. I'm gonna move back out in the channel here a little bit. See what happens. Work this channel out. See what we can do. That right there is a big fish. Hey, hey, that's a jumbo. So we get another one of them jumbos. Boy, he nailed it too. And it was at a 45 when he hit it. I mean, it was way at a 45. I was pulling along, and boom. You never know when it's gonna happen. Never know. Folks, got a nudge. He nailed it. What? He nailed it. Went out a little deeper, and I got on the side of the ridge, and one crushed it. And a good one, too. Crushed it. Okay, day. I'm talking crushed it. Hey, day he crushed it. Talk about knocking down my hand. I apologize not having the camera on. I went through a low and uh, turned it off and boom. And he took it too. He took it. Hey, they, he took it. Maybe we get some more here. Maybe we get some more here. Get him off here. All right now, all right now. Them jokers don't like that spoon in their lip. I can tell you that now. They don't like the spoon in their lip at all. Fish. Hey folks, pull over here to a little crappy brush I hadn't fished in years, and I got a crappy on, a big one too. I mean a big one. I ain't even got the net out, crappy net out. I got a striper net out. We in here, we done switched around again, and this time we got us a jumbo magnum crappy on. Huh? We sure do. We got a jumbo magnum crappy. <clears throat> Put it on spot lock. Slab crappy. Lake Murray on the nowhere close to where I caught them before. So this is another whole new area. If I can get him out of here, I'm gonna show him to you. You'll see what he hit. This little net like a when you got double rigs. You see, hey, pink lemonade, Bobby Garland, slam crappy. You got to love it. Hey, that's what we, that's what it's all about, folks. Catch a lemon of rockfish, stripers, and go catch some crappies. Hey, that's our new way of doing things around here. And he tore my jig up, so we probably gonna have to find us another jig. I don't know, it, it, it's still catchable. We're gonna try to catch a nothing with him. Got that good old slime on him now. I hate to throw him away at this point. I'm not that familiar with this spot here, so we are gonna have to move around till we get back on that sweet spot. And I really need to throw out the buoy on this one if I get back on the sweet spot. For a reference point on this one. I, this is where I caught uh, back last year a big old slab crap here on the flutter spoon. Is where I'm at right now. Flutter spoon. I'm gonna ease around here and see if I can get back on the sweet spot. Them fish are laying way down there deep by 28 foot over here. Water's a little bit clearer on this side of the lake. So they was down there deep. Let's drop it down about, it's 30 foot of water here. So we wanna go about at least four, half, five times to get down there. I don't know how much brush we got down there or if there's any more fish down there. We sure are gonna try it and see if we can catch another. We surprised one. 
Might not catch them. That ain't much brush. Just a little bit of something now, no. Might not get another bite. What I'm thinking. Go down that deep and see what happens. Probably gonna get hung up. Probably that's what's gonna happen. See you, got a nothing. Got a nothing. We got down there deeper and got a nothing. Hey, they might be laying down there on the bottom. Hey, might be laying down there on the bottom. What? Oh, what?